Mission Impossible Fallout director Christopher McQuarrie is rumored to be possible replacement for Fun 25. Daniel Craig's final outing as 007 is set to open in theaters next November and was set to be helmed by Oscar winner Danny Boyle. Unfortunately, that is no longer the case, as Boyle recently departed the project due to creative differences. Since Bond 25 was already in the midst of casting principal roles and supposed to start filming in December, it gives the producers little time to find someone else and keep the production on schedule. Fans will have their own picks until an official announcement is made and several would be more than thrilled to see McQuarrie make the leap from the IMF to MI6. He's directed arguably the strongest mission. Impossible films to date, with Fallout considered one of the best action movies in the last several years. It shouldn't come as any surprise his name has already been brought up as a possibility. Related, Mission Impossible is now better than James Bond. Justin Kroll of Variety posted on Twitter that McCory's name is being floated as a replacement for the Bond 25 gig. He cautions that this is a rumor for the time being, so viewers should definitely take this with a healthy dose of salt. Check out his post in the space below. After Rogue Nation and Fallout, McCory has clearly demonstrated a knack for delivering thrilling fast-paced action movies. Some would argue his work on Mission Impossible has elevated that franchise past Bond, which is coming off the lackluster Spectre, so McQuarrie would be a great get for Eon. However, it doesn't read as a very plausible scenario. Based on comments he's made, McQuarrie seems ready to take some time off and recharge his batteries before jumping headfirst into a new project. He just concluded the Fallout press tour, so it's unlikely he'd be willing to take on another massive task so soon. Plus, as Kroll notes, McQuarrie would prefer to develop something original next, instead of helming another sequel. There's always the possibility he gets roped in to make Mission Impossible 7 for Paramount at some point, too. McQuarrie's crafting of amazing set pieces and penchant for twisty narratives reads as the perfect match for 007. But sadly, the timing here doesn't line up. Bun 25 will have to look elsewhere for its director. Though a number of big names, like Christopher Nolan and Denis Villeneuve, are already out of the running. Even Martin Campbell, the man behind Goldeneye and Casino Royale, has said he won't return unless Bond is recast. That isn't happening until after this film. So hopefully the producers find a replacement soon. Source. Justin Kroll tags. Bond 25 looking for an AD free experience on screen rant.